Tiffany on you, you know you popping. What's up guys, I am Tiffany Blue and today I am back with another video. You know, before I jump into the scheme of things, I have to say thank you guys so much for 2K. I've been stuck at 18K, I mean, uh, 1800 for a very long time and I finally got 2K. Thank you guys to everybody who hit that subscribe button. 3K, we on the way. We're taking it step by step this year. And I'm just so glad that you guys are rocking with me thus far. So, I have been saying for the longest in video comments and in videos, if you guys pay attention, if you don't, maybe you don't believe me or whatever the case may be, I said that when I hit 2K, I want to do a giveaway. And I do want to do a giveaway. I will be giving away three pairs of lashes, glue, tweezers, and mirror. So, and this is one package, there's one big package. I'm gonna pick one person to get those items and you have to stay tuned for the rest of the video to find out how you can enter to be, you know, a nominee for the giveaway. So, stay tuned. So let's jump right into it after that long-winded intro. Uh, this is the last time that I will be reviewing this specific hair. I've had this hair for quite some time now. I ordered this hair in October, and I did not get it installed until, I want to say, you know, in November, December. And then I wore it off and on from uh, then up until basically this point. So. Now this is my final review because I feel like I've been manipulating the hair long enough to give my final opinion. So, the perks, if you have never heard or seen me do this hair review before or a video on this hair, let me just go ahead and give you a background of what's going on with this hair. This hair is from I Show Hair, and this is, um, I ordered four bundles of 222s, a 20, a 18, and a 16 inch closure. Did I say that right? Yeah, and I used one of the bundles to get a ponytail, and I used three of the other bundles in the closure to make a wig. And the wig is she. She is me, she is we, we are she. So, um, this is the hair. This is a deep wave Brazilian hair because I had that Malaysian hair before and this hair was really, really, really pretty. And I, um, that was the hair that I dyed copper and I really loved the texture of the hair, but I was really trying to stay away from Brazilian hair because I just feel like Brazilian hair is just so basic now, but whatever it is, what it is. I got this Brazilian hair, it feels really good. And to be honest, since I've been wearing the hair, I only washed it once. I know you like, girl, I know you lying. Yes, yesterday was the first time I washed this hair, like as far as since I've had it installed. So really, I only washed this hair twice, which was I washed it before I actually did the wig. And then since it's been in wig form, I washed it again. And I had the hair for quite some time for that to be my first time washing it. And the reason why I believe that I waited so long was because the hair was so low maintenance. Um, all I really did was wet it in the morning, add some serum, and kept it pushing. Um, I could finger detangle if I wanted to. This hair is just a dream to work with. Oh, final review. Will I buy this hair again? Yes. Would I recommend this hair? Yes. Do I like this hair? Yes. And I know I said this is my last review, but I kind of lied because the hair, it's not like I'm going to take it off and throw it away forever and you're never going to see it again. No. I do plan on coloring this hair, which is why I did not do a lot of products in this hair, a lot of heavy duty stuff in this hair because I do want to color this hair. As far as cons for this hair, it says, a lot and I know what you're gonna say it's curly hair it's that curly hair said yes that is fine that is true I agree however I'm just making you aware if you are somebody who is not a fan of shedding whatsoever however you feel like you've had hair before where shedding was not this bad I am going to tell you that you're going to be a little shifted with this hair because it does shed, it sheds here, there, and everywhere. But the hair is pretty, so this 
be conscious of where and when you brush your hair because you don't want to leave a trail of Brazilian at work. You just don't want to do it every time you get up from your cubicle. We see the trails of hair falling on your foot. We know it's you in the bathroom combing your hair because all of it is in the sink. We know it's you. We know. We know it's you. So, I'm just making you aware. Next, smell. The hair did not have a corn chippy. It did not have a fishy. It didn't have like a weird bad smell, but it did have that typical hair smell that sometimes if you smell it, it's kind of like, I don't want to smell like, it had like that, put it to the flat iron and curl it, almost smell, but like without it being burnt. If that makes any sense to anybody, you know what I mean? When you put hair to a flat iron, like hair store hair to a flat iron, you know the smell that you get. That's the hair, that's how the hair smelled out the pack. So once you wash it, Initially, it does come out, just to make you aware. Another thing that I do with my hair, because I had a bad experience a long time ago, is I, when I get the hair, I watch how it rinses underwater. This hair rinses very good. Sometimes I rinse hair and it's almost like it's some type of, of chemical in it because it's bubbly or like the water. It's, it's almost seems like the, the conditioner never really rinses out the hair. The hair is heavy. Or it just, it just, or you might even see dyes come out of the hair when you wet it. So none of that was that hair, and I was with this hair, and I was really happy about that. It did have like that bubbly, almost situation, but it was not like it was product on the hair. So that was a thumbs up for me. Um, or all the, the only really thumbs down about it is the shame. I mean, that's just in the closure. The closure space is very short. Um, so if you have a big forehead and you want that straight back middle part Kim Kardashian, you, I mean you can achieve it, but it won't be as like how hers is like to the middle of her head. It won't give you that. So I would definitely suggest getting maybe a frontal. Um, I have had closures where like it's a pretty decent size to where I can get that Kim K long middle part, but it's not the end of the world because this thing here is still smashing. Now, the wave pattern is deep wave. When I first got the hair, I promise you, the hair looks so different than it does now. After a couple wears, this hair does flourish, even though straight out the back, the hair is good, but like, this hair really does flourish on its own. Cause when I first got the hair, it was more of like a deep, deep wave, like a deep, chunky wave. Almost like the hair was clumped together. And then now that I wash the hair, it's like more separated, more deep curl, more wavy, more definition. Like you can see more I don't know, it's more defined, even though my, my routine, routine, my routine never changed. The only thing that I did was wash the hair. So this hair is bomb. It's still soft, it's still flowy. It has a lot of body. I'm really excited to color the hair because I know y'all sick of me in this eyeshadow hair, but I really like love this hair. And I'm trying to do reviews, like real reviews, not just Y'all see hair two weeks and then like it's gone. Like people that I relied on for hair reviews have gotten so like commercial now because I want longevity in hair. I don't want hair that's only gonna last me for two months and then I'm spending another two hundred and four hundred dollars. I want hair that I can at least wear. Real good hair is supposed to last you for at least a year. So I be wanting like some good reviews. So I just feel like I'm taking that spot that I would want for y'all so y'all can know that y'all not just wasting y'all for Cause I know how it is to put your money on some hair, you get the hair and you just like, you know what I could have did with that $380. So that's pretty much it. This is my final review on this hair. I mean, y'all will see this hair again, but it won't be a review. Maybe it might be a coloring tutorial, or maybe I might cut it. Look how 
get this for me. Cut. What? This will be so cute. Cut. Okay, y'all. So, as y'all can see, I'm cooking up more ideas on what I can do with this hair, but this is most definitely the final review. So, now it's time to get into how you can enter for my 2K giveaway. So, you already know there are rules when it comes down to these giveaways, and you already know rule number one is you have to follow me on Instagram. My Instagram name is Give Me Both, and you have to. Spam my pictures. Literally, all you have to do is go follow me and spam all my pictures. I think I have about 13 posts. Go like all 13, boom, you locked in. Okay, that's all you gotta do is go follow me on Instagram, like all my posts, boom, you're entered to win the giveaway. Once I choose a winner, I will DM you. I will ask you for your information. I will ask for your permission to announce that you are a winner here on my channel. And we're going to roll to 3K. So that's pretty much it. That's all you have to do. Y'all love me. Let me show love to y'all. And that is pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed. And like always, peace. Y'all better enter the winning song on lashes. That's all I'm saying.